And now to the award for Outstanding Achievement in Television. To present this year's award are, gosh, I can't read. I don't know how you pronounce this. Mira Seal <laughs> and Peter Allen, the Sales and Marketing Director at Television Centre. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, the winner of tonight's award is variously a TV presenter, a commentator, he's an award-winning interviewer and reporter, and is without question a larger-than-life personality whose popularity continues to grow. He's also a brilliant journalist, a consummate interviewer, and crackles with intelligence and class, whatever he does. Let's take a look at him and his career. After studying politics, philosophy and economics at Hartford College, University of Cambridge, his broadcasting career began in 1988 on BBC Two's Open to Question and Reportage. In 1991, he took over presenting children's news programme Newsround and in 1997 became one of the launch presenters for BBC News 24. In 1998, he joined Channel 4, where he has since become one of the channel's lead commentators. After reporting on the London 2012 Paralympics, the 2014 Winter Olympics and 2015's reburial of Richard III and appearing on countless broadcasts, he's one of Britain's most recognised and respected television personalities. He has been twice nominated for RTS Presenter of the Year and once for Interview of the Year and now adds the Asian Awards Outstanding Achievement in Television to his ever-growing accolades. And the winner is Krishnan Guru Murthy. Well, although his career has been largely about the facts, Krishnan Guru Murthy has also dabbled in the entertainment business. He's played himself on film, and for better or worse, he's rocked out alongside Endemol chairman Tim Hinks and Google's Peter Barron. much indeed uh, ladies and gentlemen um, I, I won't take long because like you I'm, I'm waiting to hear the master uh, Mr. Tendulkar who I have interviewed and is charming and brilliant so I'm looking forward to, uh, to hearing from him later on um, it's a great honor mostly because I've sat through the amazing achievements of the other people honored here today and so I must say I feel very very humbled by this but I just want to thank a couple of people First of all, I mean, as you've seen from the tape, I have a pretty crazy life and I go to some pretty crazy places. Uh, and I, I couldn't do it without my wife, Lisa, who is here, who um, keeps everything sane and keeps the kids happy uh, and, is, and is, is there and never tells me not to do it or never to go anywhere. Um, the other people who are here, I mean, um, you know, uh, Dad, I know uh, you can hear me now because um, you're in the room um, with my mum. Uh, and I always joke that I'm a huge disappointment to my parents because I didn't become a doctor. And I had a place at medical school which I then gave up in order to go into television, um, which is about as big a sin as you could possibly commit as an Indian boy in, in Britain. But the truth is, I wouldn't have started doing what I was doing if it wasn't for them making me do drama and debating and arguing with me around the, the family table and making sure that I was always there during dinners when their friends were there for me to be cheeky and opinionated with. And so I owe all of these sorts of things and my career uh, to my parents. And so thank you very much indeed for that. And thank you for this. <laughs> 